Sydney police say they're on the cusp of solving the murder of former bikey boss Mick Howie. He was shot dead outside a suburban gym earlier this year. Today, police raided properties across Sydney gathering evidence. In a series of morning raids, police stormed this warehouse and five homes across Sydney's southwest. Four cars were seized as part of the investigation into the execution style killing of ex bikey boss Mick Howie. At the moment, we would say there'll be a number of people feeling very uncomfortable, and we would like them to feel uncomfortable. The former Comanchero was shot dead outside this Rockdale gym in February. The gunman fled in a silver Mercedes before setting it on fire. Police have since recovered another getaway car and a tow truck thanks to new CCTV vision. We located that in Beaconsfield on a street in March and as a result of that we also found significant forensic evidence to assist us with the investigation. Detectives left this Beverly Hills house with two bags of evidence. Elsewhere they found $20,000 in cash and a portable radio used to monitor police activity. Police now believe they're closer to solving the gangland murder. With so many vehicles seized, they expect to make multiple arrests. Mick Howie spent time in jail for bashing to death Hells Angels associate Anthony Zervis in 2009. But it's unclear whether Howie's murder was an act of revenge. It is my belief that those involved in the actual murder are aware of our information and how close we are. For now, though, the killer remains on the run. Mark Reddy, ABC News, Sydney.